the Society of Pediatric Pain Medicine video pearl series. The erector spinae plane nerve block catheters. The erector spinae plane nerve block catheter is a regional technique in which a catheter is placed in the fascial plane below the erector spinae muscles. Scan from midline to lateral or vice versa. Find your landmarks and block before the step off of the transverse process to the ribs and pleura. Direct the needle towards the transverse process. Walk the needle in by decreasing the needle angle. Walk the needle and catheter in with hydrodissection. Local anesthetic is administered, blocking the dorsal and ventral rami of the thoracic and abdominal spinal nerves. The ESP nerve blocks have been used in many clinical applications. The ESP nerve block catheters have advantages over paravertebral and thoracic epidurals. ESP plane blocks are relatively easy to perform in children with no major complications reported to date. Here is some helpful advice from experienced practitioners. Stable positioning is key to help ESP placement. Swelling at the site is normal due to the volumes given. When starting, consider a needle guide for practice and speed. Getting a view of identical transverse processes help guide the needle in correct alignment. Good hydrodissection technique is key to placing the needle and catheter. Maximize volume of local anesthetic by optimizing to lower concentrations and alternating sides to increase ESP block spread. Remember sterile technique, secure fixation, and pressure padding are also very important. Density of the ESP nerve block technique is similar to other fascial plane blocks. Success with ESP nerve block catheters depend on a multidisciplinary team approach. From the Society of Pediatric Pain Medicine, thank you.